What's going on, y'all? It's your boy T Man, right back in the attic, right back at it for another day of this battle rap. That was just round one. We just got done. I just got done checking out round one between KCJ versus Prep. Um, I'm gonna just do a quick little rundown of what I think went down. You know what I'm saying? Um, basically the first round, um, I think Casey came out on fire. She had the Floyd Mayweather line. I think that was dope. You know what I'm saying? She had the uh, she had the Miss Hustle on top. You should be used to being six feet under line. I guess he was fucking with uh, Miss Hustle. I thought that shit was dope. You know what I'm saying? Um, you miss your ex like Rough Riders. I don't know, man. I think it's a little bit too soon. You know what I'm saying to be on those uh, DMX bars, but it was it was a fire bar. I just think, come on, man, it's a little too soon. You know what I'm saying. Then we had the um, how you break that girl ribs angle. Like he was talking, she was talking about. I guess he broke his ex ribs, but he said it. You know what I'm saying. Whatever. We get into that. Said something about being caged in. It, it sounded dope. Um, then you had prep. He got into the, um, he brought the proof or whatever about the whole scenario or situation with um, his ex because he felt like he knew that she was going to bring it up, which was a rebuttal in my opinion, but I don't think it was enough um, prep because prep basically started choking early. He started choking early. Like, it ain't take him no time. That boy was choking. You feel what I'm saying? So we going to go ahead and... um. We we starting to we starting to look like it, it it looked like what'd he say a couple decent lines you know what I'm saying he had a couple decent lines but he was he was stumbling he was stumbling and fumbling that round so I gave that first round to uh Casey J so it's one oh Casey J going into round two round two Casey J up you're gonna need more than Nunu to to uh get your teeth right you know what I'm saying that was dope um you about to die in front of your in front of freeway again that's roll kill you know nice nice or whatever then boom a couple stumbles here and there like she wasn't stumbling crazy crazy but she got enough stumbles in for me to be like all right, man, she tripping. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't it wasn't enough for me to just say she choked, but it was enough for me to say she was stumbling and fumbling. And the judges ain't interested in any um stumbling and fumbling. So basically, I gotta give um let's go in the prep prep ain't he said a little bit that round, you know what I'm saying? He had the um mac and cheese bars to get it started. He had the Maxwell's Woman's Worth bars. I like that one. I think that was dope. He was consistent throughout that round. I had to get that to him. I gave that to prep. Um, then, then you know what I'm saying? Casey J third round, the smoke and mirrors line, the Debo line. Um, it was pretty dope. Lead in the, you know what I'm saying? Then, then prep, prep came back with the lead in the sis, Chris Paul, the Monday Night Raw. Oh my God, that line was dope. I gave that second one to prep. I gave the uh, third one to prep. I gave prep this battle. Um, two one. You know what I'm saying? I like I like the way Casey J came. She ain't come like no slouch this this uh battle. I don't think she did at all. But in my opinion, I can't give her the win. I gotta go ahead and um give this one to the boy prep. So I'm about to check it out these judges, see what they think or whatever. And um, you know what I'm saying, I'm gonna keep it moving. It's your boy T Main, right back in the attic, right back at it for another day of this battle rap shit. And we gonna get to this next battle. We're gonna recap that as well. Alright, peace.